Hey everyone, Bill Lethman here for MoneyEvolution.com. In today's video blog, I want to talk about something I call the pension double dip strategy. So we're located here in Michigan, outside of Detroit, and we have a lot of automotive uh, clients, a lot of people that work for Ford, GM, or Chrysler. And like a lot of companies, uh, Ford, GM, and Chrysler have all frozen their pension plan. So what that means essentially is that uh, many of these people are not getting any further pension benefits. Uh, in other words, their pension's locked in place right now. And what's more is that some of these companies allow them to begin collecting their pension benefits as early, in some cases, as age 58, and have them be unreduced. Uh, in other words, they're gonna get the same amount at age 58 that they would get uh, even if they waited all the way until age 65. So there's really no benefit for them to work those additional seven years in terms of what they could collect from their pension. Uh, and again, some of these companies also offer something we refer to as the Social Security Pension Bridge. And so what that means essentially is that if they retire prior to age 62, which is the earliest age that you can begin collecting Social Security benefits, uh, they're going to give you a supplemental pension. Uh, usually it's between $800 and as maybe as much as $1,200 a month that you're going to get every month in those months prior to you turning age 62. Uh, so that adds up to a lot of money. So what we've had a lot of clients do here is they actually retire from one company, they turn that pension benefit on, let's say at age 58, and then they go work for one of the competing companies and hopefully they can make pretty close to the same amount of money that they were making before. So a quick example of this is let's say you're making $100,000 working for one of the companies and you can collect your pension benefit at age 58. So you can retire at 58, begin collecting that pension, let's say it's $20,000 a year, and then maybe you're also gonna get that Social Security pension bridge, which we'll say is another $10,000 a year. So you're gonna get $30,000 in pension benefits uh, at least over those first seven years of retirement. Now, if you go work uh, for another company, and let's say you can make the same $100,000 working for one of the competitors, now you've just increased your income from $100,000 a year to $130,000 a year. And that can really be huge in terms of helping you uh, prepare and plan for retirement. So that extra money, you could use that to save more money uh, for your retirement if you're maybe a little bit behind. Uh, if you wanna put more money into your 401k plan or fund a IRA, Roth IRA account, you can do that. Uh, if you wanna use it to pay down some debt, maybe you wanna pay off some bills, maybe you want to more aggressively pay down your mortgage and get your mortgage paid off uh, before you retired. Uh, there's a lot that you can do with that and it can really help you uh, get your retirement back, back in a pretty good position. Uh, and then the other option is that you could just use it to say, hey, I'm gonna work for a different company. Maybe that uh, even entails a little bit uh, less stress or a little bit more freedom. And then now you've got that extra $30,000, maybe you and your spouse, or you could do some nice traveling and you could go some places that you wanna go because now you've got that extra income coming in and you're healthy enough to, to do that. So anyway, it's a great strategy. We've been doing it here quite a bit. In fact, it's actually getting really uh, popular and actually getting a little bit funny because we've got clients that are just going from Ford to GM and GM to Chrysler and Chrysler to GM and, and we're seeing a lot of activity going on, especially with that uh, age bracket that are in that uh, 58 and above uh, bracket there where they're getting close to retirement. So anyway, hope you found this video helpful. Uh, if you're watching this video any place other than our blog at moneyevolution.com, head over there. We've got lots of great free resources available, uh, other video blogs and articles that hopefully can help you with your retirement planning. So that's it for this video. Thank you and I'll see everyone back here soon. Thanks.